Woo! It was basic combinations like this that helped me win an Olympic bronze medal. It doesn't matter if it's your first time ever boxing or you've been boxing for a long time. You should always practice these kind of combinations because they will help you get better at boxing. Combination number three is a one, two, one, one, two. Now, as you notice there, it's all straight punches. And when you do this correct and fast, like I'm about to show you, it does look very impressive. And I'm gonna give you some tips on how to throw this even faster. But also this combination, it's a realistic combination. I would use this for cutting the distance down on an opponent who was moving on the back foot, like a one, two, one, one, two. I would move forward as I'm throwing it. But on the bag, you can do it in place. Again, we're gonna throw one, two, one, one, two. You wanna be fully extending your arms on each punch, not coming too close where it's like a or it's just arm punches but long so now i'm going to speed it up a little bit before i show you in full speed one two one one two and already there it looked decent right but when you throw it even faster it's going to look even better and the way to throw fast is think about this sound ba 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 one two one one two ba 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 now if you think about the sound of the speed i can match that speed when i throw the punches one, two, one, one, two. It looks like this. <laughs> now, basic combination number two. Again, it's a realistic combination. All my combinations are realistic. And it is a, the most basic combination you can throw when you're going to add in a body shot as well. It's going to be a one, one, two to the body. And then from there, we're going to come up with a hook to the head. One, one, two to the body. When you come up with a hook to the head, very important that you bring this two back to your face. People will often forget about this one and they'll throw the hook and this will come down here and they'll look silly. They'll do a one, one, boom, boom. You need to bring your hand back to your face. You always need to have your non-punching hand by your face. Let's keep the technique right. So you throw the jab out, bring it all the way back, jab out. As it's coming back the second time, now this is important with this combination, you're gonna bend your knees and turn your hips as you throw this two to the body. Then from there, you're gonna bring this two to the body back to your face. You're gonna straighten your legs just a little bit as they're straightening and that's coming back to the face. That's when the hook's coming out and you're gonna transfer the weight to the back foot to throw that hook. Now let's add a little bit of speed into this one. <laughs> Okay, now it's time for number one. The most basic combination of all three of these. I would love to know what your favorite boxing combination is. Drop me a text and let me know. And I'll be texting you back, telling you about my new videos. Okay, so moving on to number one. Now this is the most basic one, but this is the combination I used to work on all the time that helped me have so much success in my boxing career. And that is a one, two, one, two. Now, the trick is with this, you're not just thinking about speed, you're thinking about about power as well. This is a great combo to generate that power. Now the way to get power into this is by turning your hips to transfer your weight. If I throw the one, two, one, two like this, what I see with beginners, <laughs> I'm not getting any power. That's arm punches. I want to turn into it. Now when I turn my hips, you can see there the power of the, of the punch increases a lot. Now when I'm pulling this one back, that's when this one comes out. When I'm pulling this one back, this one comes out. So it's not one, two, one, two. It's one, two, one, two. As it's coming back, the other one's coming out. So now when I throw this at full speed with full power, it will look like this. <laughs> now that you've mastered the three basic combinations, you're ready for the advanced ones. Click here and check out these advanced realistic combinations for you to try.